Well, folks, how y'all doing? Welcome back in. Oh, man, what do you got there, Tom? This, uh, I saw this at Sam's Club. Uh, it says it's beef chuffs, chuck steak trade. And all this is is chuck steak that they cut thin. Uh, so um, we're going to try this. I, I think we're going to marinate this. Remember, chuck steak uh, is a little bit on the tough side. So we're going to marinate it, and uh, we'll give you a look, see how we do that. Keep on folks, watching. Uh, we're getting things ready. I just sprayed a little olive oil. I am using a little bit of this uh, Montreal steak seasoning on there. And then I'm, I'm using my uh, food saver. I got one of them done here. She's using it to marinate. Now I'm using, believe it or not, I'm using Coca-Cola. Actually works pretty nice. So uh, we'll get this in the bag, show you how it works on the food saver. Stay tuned. Folks, that's, I'm sorry, that's how it works. I got carried away. I got them all done. So uh, got it in there, got the Coke in there. Uh, how, how long you want to do it for is up to you. I'm going to let it go for maybe two hours. Put them back and put them in the fridge like this. And then um, we'll fire up one of the charcoal grills and uh, we'll get a nice sear on these and see how they turn out. Keep on watching. All right, folks, there it is. There's the old smoky, the modified old smoky. So what we're going to do here today, and I already got the charcoal going, is that when I moved the grill grates up, uh, that gave me an opportunity to get the charcoal, to get the fire closer to the grate. So got my second level there. I'm using the old smoky um, charcoal grate and I've got everything spread out there. I'm going to let this get just a little bit hotter and then uh, we'll go ahead and uh, throw our chuck steak on and see what happens. Keep on watching. All right folks, fire is hot enough. Let's try putting these on. Got a little discombobulated. Lay it over the coals. Put one in reserve here, off to the side, and we'll give you a look. See as we progress. All right, folks, I've had them over the charcoals here, but I'm kind of moving around a little bit here. And what I'm going to do here is now I'm going to kind of go off to the side with them, and uh, then I'm going to put my lid on and just kind of let this get some heat to them for uh, just a couple minutes, and then, uh, like I said, this is thin steak, so. We'll let them go for like our two or three minutes and then we'll take them off and we'll give you a look. Right, so these have been about uh, five, seven minutes. Old Smokey says she's about 250. Let's take a look. Oh yeah, looking pretty nice. We're going to pull these off and uh, we'll give you a look-see. Well folks, there it is. Chuck steak um, marinated then cooked on the Old Smokey. Um, you can take a look here. She's a medium rare or more to the, a little bit more than medium rare. Um, I've actually tasted a piece and it's, it's not bad. I mean, this is not, you know, about presentation, uh, but if you want to feed the family, it was some steak, uh, definitely chuck steak, marinated. Uh, I can taste uh, a little, a little bit of the sweetness from the Coca-Cola in there. But other than that, it's, um, it's pretty decent and, uh, give it a shot. I, I hope this was helpful. Uh, I can't say that I'll make this again. Um, maybe, maybe not. I'm not sure. But, but I'd rather have a nice ribeye. So uh, leave a comment, thumbs up. And as always, folks, uh, Tom Horseman at YouTube. And thanks for watching.